Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another nerdy unboxing video, hence the wall of nerd. Uh, yeah, so I thought I would take advantage of the fact that I'm still wearing makeup before I scrub it all off of my face <laughs> and record another video since I have a new figure to unbox. <laughs> so I did go back and pick up the Batgirl figure from the DC Collectibles Artist Alley collection. Um, so now I have two out of the four figures. I'm really excited about this this one, you know, I'm halfway there. Um, and I thought I would just open it up with you guys because the last one, who's right, no, is that, where is she? Oh, oh, she's down here. She's right here. The last one's right here and she's super adorable and I love her. So I thought we'd open up the next one with you guys make it a little series. Uh, we'll see if we can collect all four and then we'll see if we can start on a another version of the set or start on another collection. I'd kind of like to collect the entire series of these ones. Eh, there she is. But um, they're at the minimum twice the price. I'm getting ahead of myself here. So this is the box of the artwork for the Batgirl super adorable it's just like this gray and white version of it on the side and this time the box has all four in the series so there is harley quinn poison ivy batgirl and catwoman the entire collection is on the side of this box as well as on the back it has the batgirl versions of both the regular and the holiday edition collection listed um those ones are not listed on the back of the poison ivy box so this must have been the most recent and the last figure uh, added to the collection but again it does have the artist little bio thing on it as well um, but we don't really care about the box all that much we just want to see the figure all right so I'm sorry if I am sniffly guys um, I just got back from skating outside of the park downtown and so I've been outside in the cold for a long time and I'm inside in the heat and my nose is very sniffly and like oh my eyes are all red from the temperature change like it's so cold outside that my eyes started watering it's ridiculous all right so as with the poison ivy one thank you light uh, there is this little packet just has a blank card as well as a small print of the actual art that this figure is based off of. This is so pretty. Um, I think I'm going to wait until I have the collection of all four and then get the four of them matted up into one frame before I hang them because I think that would look really, really cool. So really excited about those now that I have an actual plan of what to do with them. Because like I didn't want to stick thumbtacks, I didn't want to stick thumbtacks through them, but now I won't have to. I just have to finish collecting the set. And then of course we have the Batgirl figure itself. So, so the Poison Ivy is number one thousand five hundred eighty-four out of three thousand, and the Batgirl is number one thousand one hundred and forty-one out of. 3,350. So there were a few more of the Batgirl made. Uh, doesn't mean I'm gonna love her any less. She's adorable. Um, but yeah. Hmm. There are some smudges on her base, but she was in a display cabinet from the shop I bought her in. So it's all good. Anyway, yeah. So she doesn't have this like wild, crazy sculpted base that Poison Ivy does. She just has a round circular base with the DC collectibles and all the info on the bottom but here she is her little adorable bat cowl face and like her hair is like swooshing all over the place and I love how the red bleeds through there in areas and like it's got the white highlights that are classic for this collection and again, because of the series, it is just black, white, and red, which is fantastic. She's got her little Batgirl logo and her belt. She's like, she's got her little gloves, which are adorable. Got a little, a little batarang in here, which is super cute. 
but she's she's definitely a little simpler her cape is by far the best part of it it's all like swooshy and spiky and amazing <laughs> and then she has her kind of chunky combat motorcycle boots down here with the little white lacing she's fairly simple compared to poison ivy definitely more detail than poison ivy but she's adorable and i'm super happy to have her i hope you guys enjoyed unboxing her with me um i hadn't looked at her in person yet so that's kind of cool um i had just seen her behind the glass <laughs> Anyway, that is it for today's unboxing video. What is happening here? Jeez. If you guys want to check out any of my cosplay stuff or my other social media links, places, those are all in the description box down below. There's my Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. My Twitch is in there, though I haven't been on there in ages. I should really do that more often, but I just don't have the time right now. Uh, but you can definitely check those out. Go ahead and hit the like or the follow buttons on those. and It is greatly appreciated. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button because uh, then I know to keep doing these unboxings because there are definitely two more in this series that I will be collecting. So I'd love to open those up with you guys when I get them. And then uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you want to see more from me in the future, whether it's these unboxing things, my more like kawaii stuff, or if you're only here for the cosplay, I guess that's okay too. There's more of that coming up and I will see you guys next time. Bye!